Hello, my lovelies. My name is Shannon, and I am the CEO and owner of Scrumptious Ink, Urban Skin, and Hair Care Apothecary. This video is to kind of go over what fenugreek benefits are for hair growth. It's not only just for hair. Fenugreek is a wonderful Ayurvedic herb that has been used throughout the healthcare region with natural naturopathic healthcare, not only for hair care, but also for skin, for general health, and for preventing hair shedding and hair fall. It has been used across the board in Indian healthcare based on their Ayurvedic practices, which is basically the study of life and health. It is a herb that can be used in seed form or in powder form. In either form, it is beneficial in increasing protein for the hair. It is great for amino acids. It stops hair fall and shedding. It also stops premature graying and adds shine and luster to the hair along with helping to soothe itchy scalp and keeping the scalp healthy and helping to keep hair follicles laying flat and nice and healthy. As far as fenugreek goes for naturopathic care, it can be used for producing increased breast milk. It could be used to balance testosterone. It's also great for balancing digestion and also for menstrual pain. If you are interested in those type of things for fenugreek, it can also be used in pill form where you can take it internally and also use it topically for the face to help skin stay nice and smooth and healthy and glowing. But today we are talking about its properties for hair, specifically hair, hair, hair. I myself have been using fenugreek for about a year now. I will post a picture here <laughs> to show you exactly where I started a year ago before I started my Ayurvedic hair care regimen. I used to have hair that was pretty much at ear length and it was something that I thought my hair was healthy but in reality it was very dry, it was very brittle and it was breaking off consistently. I was not retaining length and I was not keeping my hair moist. I also was washing my hair probably three times a week and just basically losing the health of my hair. Even though I was natural, I was not a healthy natural. But once I did discover Ayurveda, I found different herbs that actually helped to strengthen hair and also help to retain my length. That way I wasn't breaking off every time I was combing my hair or brushing it. So of course the regimen did change full on once I did start using Ayurveda, but fenugreek did play a major part in that. Fenugreek is so great for hair because it helps to, once again, prevent hair fall. Basically, it is high in protein and it's also high in nicotinic acid, so it prevents any type of penetration of dryness into the hair and it helps to retain moisture. So it basically puts a nice sealant over the hair shaft, that way protein helps to keep that hair lying flat. It prevents hair from rubbing up against each other so it's no longer tangling and causing fairy knots and also causing hair to break off at points where it's not supposed to break off. It allows you to keep your retain length from your hair as opposed to thinking that your hair is not growing, which everyone's hair is growing throughout the year. It doesn't not grow. It's just that we don't see the growth because most likely it's breaking off. For us, fenugreek can be used in powder form or in its seed form. I Some of the downsides to using fenugreek are that it does have a pretty pungent odor of maple syrup. That can always be kind of hidden or covered up using essential oils that would benefit also in your growth phase. You can use rosemary, you can use lavender, you can use neroli or orange. Any of those scents will help block that scent. That way you would be able to use it as a daily rinse. If you wanted to, you could use it as a spritz. But do remember, fenugreek is protein. So if you are protein sensitive, you don't want to use fenugreek on a daily basis. It would most likely be a weekly thing where you would use it as a hair mask or a hair rinse, like a tea, after just simply steeping those seeds and creating a liquid and using that in a spritzer bottle for your hair 
re-moisturizing, okay? <laughs> so usually when you do use fenugreek, you can spritz it on the hair, keeping it nice and moist and saturating the hair, but you wanna follow it with some sort of oil. That way it would seal in the moisture that you just supplied your hair with. The purpose of fenugreek is not only just to strengthen hair, it actually, fenugreek is an all around amazing, amazing herb that is going to help with hair growth, mad hair, hair growth, crazy, crazy, crazy. So from this picture, I have now grown in one year and sustained my length and I am now at armpit length here. So I know it doesn't look that long when it is in its normal state, but once it's stretched, it does get past my bra strap, strap right here. <laughs> so fenugreek is something that can be utilized in a hair wash, it can be in a shampoo, it can be in a spritz. Whatever you decide to use it as, it is a simple added tool to your hair care regimen. So it's not going to be something that Fenugreek is also an amazing deep conditioner. So uh, we happen to actually carry our own line of deep conditioners. It is a restorative hair mask that is a fenugreek restorative hair mask on our line for Scrubbages Inc. It is a dry mix that can be pre-mixed with milk or water and added to your favorite conditioner. That way it's an easier way of actually achieving a deep conditioner without having to go and get all the products and all the powders and things like that. If you do not feel like going out and getting those, you can always purchase it from our site on our Etsy and on our website at scrumptiousinc.net, also on our Etsy shop at Scrumptious Inc. It's pretty simply made. You can go ahead and just add the powder to some milk or water, mix that paste and add it to avocado, mayonnaise, yogurt, your favorite conditioner again, and just use that as your deep conditioner. Fenugreek is, again, one of the most amazing herbs that you will ever use in your hair and you will see results from it. After this little snippet, you will go ahead and see our tutorial on how to use it. It's gonna be our dry seed mix and also our powdered mix. So you can use either of those options to get you on your way to use of fenugreek. Thank you so much for watching.